everyone to the Aquaware 5 custom intent sessions and QLS. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to combine both a ALS intent which is a Aquaware layering session intent and a custom intent to build a QLS or a quantum layering session. So I've already showed you in the QLS video how the ALS files work in conjunction with building a QLS and I've also showed you in the custom intent sessions how you build a custom intent and it saves it. What I didn't tell you was that it also when you save it saves it out as an ALS file as well. So in brief we will select any intent we want for demonstration purposes set the empower level and we'll just run this one force field electronic devices enhancements so we'll let this run all intents run for 13.1 seconds and I'm going to show you from this intent and a custom one how you combine them into a QLS so from here we're going to say yes to save it and we'll notice that it saves it with a given name and we can change the name to whatever we want but for the the demonstration in this video I'll leave it as is. So we click Save and that is now saved as an ALS file. And now we come over to the Advanced Features tab and we're going to build a custom intent session very quickly. We'll just grab an image that really resonates with us and we will go ahead and type in Okay, we'll select a power level, we'll click save, we'll go ahead and put some fractals on the screen where it resonates with us and again you'll notice and I want you to take particular notice of the number down here because the name of this custom intent as it gets saved out as an ALS file will have these characters first, this number, okay, it's very very important. We go ahead and nucleate the water. Water prep runs for 3.1 seconds. User prep runs for 3.1 seconds. Now we are nucleating for 13.1 seconds. When the session is done, we can come over here to the drop down and you'll notice again here is our custom intent and notice this number here 49377 so now we're going to combine the intent that we ran which is already saved as an ALS file the custom intent which is also stored in the gallery but also saved as an ALS file so we go to build quantum layering session or build QLS and we will first grab our force field intent which is right here and we'll drag it to here and then we will look for our number and oh my gosh I, for, I forgot which one it was <laughs> well let's just say it was this one <laughs> so now you'll notice that we have our original ALS file the first intent that we ran which was the force field intent I'm sorry this is here and then this was our custom intent. We're going to click Save. And now we'll run that. And again, water prep runs for 3.1 seconds. User prep runs for 3.1 seconds. We are nucleating both intents. This is our custom intent. And this is our force field electronic enhancement intent. So again, folks, the, the whole premise of this video is to show you the power and the flexibility of creating a QLS with custom intent sessions that you wrote, plus ALS ones, which are really pre-canned intents that you saved, and kind of bring the whole dynamics together. The advanced features of the QLS and the 
the custom intent sessions in Aquaware 5 are unparalleled to anything I've ever created. They are very, very powerful. They are dynamic. And of course, they are ever expanding. The more you use it, the better it gets. Thank you.